So I'm a neurologist by training and I had a background and interest in motor systems. Motor systems are the part of the brain that control the way you move. The space that I'm in is called brain-computer interfaces. This new emerging space is attempting to find ways to bring the signal out of the brain and then connect it to the outside world for people who are locked inside their own head. In spinal cord injury, for example, if the cord is damaged, you can't reconnect the spinal cord. So how would you take that data, the brain attempting to move, and put it back in control of some system that can give that patient mobility again? So this is a stentrode. The idea with this is to get near the part of the brain which you can control by thinking about moving parts of your body to deliver a array that contains sensors inside a blood vessel next to that part of the brain and then bring that down through the neck and into a unit that sits in the chest, much like a pacemaker box, which enables wireless communication to the outside world. I suppose one way of thinking about what this device is, it's that a digital spinal cord in that the spinal cord normally carries information in and out of the brain. This will be a digital mechanism of getting information in and out of the brain.